Hi guys, I had a haul from Bath & Body Works, their candles were on sale, and a couple of pair of boots from Target. So first up, let's talk about this ginormous, ridiculous bag from Bath & Body Works. Um, their candles were on sale 2 for 20, which is the reason that I went, and they gave me this like huge, huge bag. And they have these new like cardboard inserts that they put in the bags to keep the candles separated. So I think that's why I got this giant bag, but I just thought it was crazy that I got this gigantic bag. So when it comes to candles, I tend to be a fan of the spicy cinnamony candles. Not too spicy, not like a man spicy, but just um, cinnamon and spice kind of spices. So when I walked into the store, the very first one that I saw was Holiday. And I thought, I'll give this one a smell. So Holiday is described as a fragrance that captures the warmth and spices of the holidays with a special blend of cinnamon, clove highlighted by sprightly bergamot. And this one smells like cinnamon trident gum. Oh, it smells so good. It's that perfect mix of cinnamon and cloves and just, oh, it smells like Christmas. I have these like cinnamon ornaments that I make and they're made out of like cinnamon and applesauce and glue and stuff and you dry them and year after year after year they smell like cinnamon heaven and that's what this smells like. Oh here, you wanna sniff? You wanna sniff? Okay, okay, there you go. Get a sniff. <laughs> and these were the um, the big three wick candles that were on sale, two for 20. So I mean, normally they are $20 a piece. So I mean, $10 for candles is still kind of expensive, honestly. It's just a candle. <laughs> I don't know. Um, so two for 20 is the only way that I will buy these. I don't spend $20 a candle. So yeah, love holiday. So I love holiday so much that I bought two because it smells fantastic. And usually cinnamon and cloves is my favorite, but this holiday candle might be my new favorite. It's just, oh, it smells like heaven. So speaking of cinnamon and clove, I also picked up a cinnamon and clove and I actually get this scent like all the time. I think it's available year round. So I get it year round. And this one actually comes with the gold lid. And this one says White Barn, but these two, the holiday ones, say Slatkin & Co. I don't know if Bath & Body is having an identity crisis or what, but... So this one says, a warmly spicy scent that recalls beloved family holiday traditions. Classic cinnamon, simmering clove buds, and exquisite vanilla. And that is exactly what this smells like. And it comes in this really um, deep purpley brown shade, which is great for the holidays, and so is the red one. It just smells like, um, you know, ginger snap cookies, kind of, but more cinnamony. And the last candle I got was a Slatkin & Co. Sparkling Icicles, which I have never seen this one before, and I, I don't know, I'm not a big fan of, like, sweet scents, and this one sounded like it was a sweet scent, but it's not. It says, as sparkling and luminescent as icicles are in a trees under a winter's moon, this fragrance combines moss, bergamot, and the perfect finishing touch, a citrus bouquet. Oh my gosh. And this one honestly reminds me of like, Hollister or Abercrombie and Fitch. I don't know, it just smells so good. Maybe it smells like Hollister. It kind of almost smells beachy to me. And it's just a white candle, um, and it has this really pretty label on the front of it. It smells beachy. It smells like heaven. Oh my gosh, I might have to go get more of this um, sparkling icicles, because I'm, you know, this is definitely a holiday one. They're going to have sparkling icicles in, like, May, so. Oh, that smells so good. I wish my bedroom smelled like this. Oh, I'm gonna have to start burning this one like now. I should go light it over there. And then the last thing I bought was this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful candle holder. Um, it has this classic pattern on it, which can be used year round. And I think this one, yeah, this one is $8.50. And I had a coupon, um, I actually used, let me show you. So I have this app on my phone called Coupon Sherpa. 
And if you go on into the App Store and you type in Coupon Sherpa, C-O-U-P-O-N space S-H-E-R-P-A, um, and it's got this little guy as a symbol. So you click on that and this is what opens up, the Coupon Sherpa. And then it has a list of all of these stores that you can use. So let's see, where's Bath & Body Works? So once we click on Bath & Body Works, it's going to show us what kind of coupons are available. And the coupon that is available is save 10 when you spend 30 or more. So when I click on that, it's going to take me to this screen. And then I'm going to click on view coupon. And then right there on the screen, it has the store's coupon. And it tells you the dates that it expires and the code. And if there's a scanny thing, there's a scanny thing there. Um, so I use this all the time, especially when I go to Bath & Body Works. And that way you don't have to carry coupons with you. And it has stuff on there for like Kohl's or major retailers. I mean, it just has like everything in here, just an absolute ton of stores. And then you have to take your coupons with you. So I obviously use the two for 20 deal twice, which is 40. So I got four candles for 40. Um, so I got $10 off. So it really it was four candles for 30, which makes them like, 750 a candle or something like that and then as a treat i bought myself this fun candle holder and i will show you what it looks like with the candle in it so i'll turn the label around omg how stinging adorable is that so this was the last one otherwise i probably would have bought two so that i had a matching set oh it is so stinking cute I might keep it here on my um, vanity. Oh, it's so good. It smells so good. And then you can put the lid on there and just look at that. It's on this adorable little pedestal. I just can't even get over how cute this is. Then time for Target. I ordered two pairs of boots on Target online. I ordered a black pair and a brown pair and I was looking for some riding boots. I have like Ugg style boots and I have um, like boots with heels but I wanted like some like flat boots which I have never worn in the past and I don't know I just really haven't been that into them but this year I was like you know what I really like the look of the riding boots so I wanted to get some. So here is the black pair and how stinking adorable is this. So it has um, like a little detail there and a double band that goes around the ankle. And I wore these the other day and these are really comfortable and I'm super picky about shoes uh, being comfortable or not and these are super comfortable so that is what they look like and then they have the um, split back here at the calf very like sort of true to riding style and then it zips all the way down right here so it doesn't fully zip down but um, I actually kind of like that because I think ugh, it's hitting me in the face. I actually think it's easier to put on that way. So then you put your foot in and you put it on. Um, and this is actually pretty true to size. This is a nine and a half. Um, I actually normally wear between a nine and a nine and a half. I just thought it was probably better to get a half size bigger in boots. Or a full size bigger because it's winter and you're going to want to wear bigger socks so I felt like this is really true to size they fit fantastic and these are by Morona and let me see so I'm looking at my online receipt here so these are by Morona and they are the Cadence women's boot in black and I know that they had them in other colors but I think the other colors are like sold out in my size so these are beautiful and they come up um i'm gonna say like a couple inches below the knee not a whole bunch below the knee but they pretty much go up your whole calf and they are super comfy and they have this like teeny tiny little heel back here but yeah love these oh and i think i got them for like 35 or 40 dollars on target online and sometimes actually they have like a buy one get one 50 percent off on shoes um so just keep your eyes out for that and honestly i think a lot of their riding boots or just their boots in general were selling out online and i know it's pretty early into the season and i know 
some places it's not very cold yet, especially where I live. Um, so by the time it actually gets cold and people want boots, they're going to be sold out. So if you're looking for some boots, especially riding boots, Target has some fantastic ones online. So here is the brown pair, and this is in the color chestnut, is what they're calling it. So this pair has like a buckle up here. There's no split at the back, and it has sort of a similar zipper that starts actually maybe a little further down. Um, I haven't worn these yet, and it has the buckle detail right there, and these are in a 10, so these are half size bigger than the other, and like I said, I wear between a 9 and a 9.5 usually, and these are by Journey Collection? I don't know. I think these ones are available only on Target.com, and on here it says Buckle Detail Boot. Asiana. That's what they are. Anywho. Um, yeah, so they are flat as well. These ones almost look a little bit more westerny than the others, but they are still a riding boot. They are just a different color. And instead of having like a double strap, it just has a single buckle. And these were also um, $35 to $40 online, something like that. And I just thought that these would be great for fall because the other boots that I have are both black pairs of boots. Well, the Uggs that I have are black and then the heel boots that I have are black. Um, and then those riding boots are black. So this will be my first, you know, brown pair of boots, which is kind of sad. Hmm, I should probably get some more boots. Anyway, I'm loving the riding boot trend that is in this year. I'm pretty tall, so sometimes I don't necessarily want to be in heels, but I still want to be fashionable, so I am super happy that I found these online. So once again, if you want to go shop the Target website for boots, I would really suggest that you go check it out because it was there was a couple other pair of boots that I really like, but they just didn't have my size and they were sold out in tons of sizes. So. Check it out if you want to go find some boots because they are selling out even though it's hardly even fall yet. Anywho, I hope you guys have a fantastic week and I will see you in my next video. Bye!